What is up, guys? Today we're going to be going over how to get the Swords of Justice at Pokemon Sword and Shield Crown Tundra DLC. So, let's get into it. So, first things first, to get this quest, you're going to have to complete the whole post game of Sword and Shield where you battle Hop, Shieldbert, Swordward, and grab your designated legendary. Then, Professor Sonya will show up, tell you that there's three legendaries roaming around because you'll do a little cutscene with some footprints. You're gonna have the grassland, cavern, and the iron will Pokemon. Now the grassland can be found in the giant's bed. The cavern can be found by the Dyna tree and the lakeside cave. The iron will can be found in three point pass and the roaring sea caves, as well as frigid sea. There's a little island to go off onto. Now I would make a full where all the footprints are but if you see here i have two in front of me this is going to be the last one for the cavern i only need one because there's more footprints than you need only need 50 because they go up by two so if i collect this one it puts me at 100 now watch that back footprint it disappears so no matter what you're going to have more footprints than you do and what you're actually going to need but that is what the cavern footprint looks like go on to the grassland and show you that one so the cavern pokemon was like two big hoof prints which was very obvious in the dirt the grassland are two little little green ones in the giant's bed so that'll put us at 100 and now let's show the iron will footprint so for the iron will you get these little ones in the snow so you can kind of tell where they are on the map. So we'll collect that one. Now we have all of them at 100%. We'll need to go talk to Professor Sonia and she will tell us exactly where they are so we can catch them. So now we're turning in our evidence at Sonia. The Iron Wall, 100%. Cavern, 100%. And Grassland, 100%. So all we need for all of them is her Pokemon Finder. And now we're going to be able to catch them. Lakeside Cave, Frigid Sea, and Giant's Bed. So we're going to start with the grassland on this one. Because you're going to start here whenever you're talking to uh, Sonya. You just come down to the Giant's Bed. And just hug right. You'll run right into him. And it'll be Verizion. You know Verizon Wireless. Which is a grass I'm fighting. So you need to keep that in mind. But you just keep hugging right. And there he is. Now I would recommend dropping down a save. Then you can encounter him. Now can be shiny hunted you keep that in mind so you can knock him out get out of the area come back and he's there or just do little resets little soft resets so now we call Brizion which is the grass field Pokemon one member swords of justice one thing to keep in mind is you can shiny hunt him so you can do resets about a three percent catch rate and spore has no effect on him so you'd need like a hypnosis to put him to sleep you now you want to go full swipe knock him down to one hp put him to sleep that'll give you the best catch rate but let's get on to the iron will pokemon so for the iron will if you fast travel to the reggies it'll pretty much put you right where you need to be because you'll be able to come right down this ramp And on that little island, we'll find Cabalion. Oop, there he is. Again, drop down to save. Because you as well can shiny high him. And go to catch him. Now we got Cabalion to the party. So now we have Verizion and Cabalion. Both of them can be shiny hunted. He is a steel fighting, so kind of a little bit tougher. But put him to sleep. 
one HP. Doesn't make it a problem. So now let's get on to the cavern Pokemon, Terrakion. So Terrakion will be found in the lakeside cave over by the Dino Tree. Go inside the cave, it'll be all the way to the left and a little open. Right over here. And again, drop down to save. Then encounter him. So with adding him to the, to our team, we now have all the members of the sword of justice. Brachion, Parisian, and Cabalion. Now keep in mind, they all can be shiny hunted. So you can do soft resets for them. You can do the knockout, uh, leave and come back. And they have a about a 3% catch rate. But that's how you get the Swords of Justice with them, Pokemon Sword and Shield, Crown Tundra DLC. If you found this helpful, drop it a like. Comment down below which of these three is your favorite. Mine's Terrakion. Really good competitively. He is really bulky. But I'll catch you guys in the next one.